Oh yeah. This is Bri. Hi everyone, I'm Hala Hassan and today I'm gonna to be making one of my favorite recipes. It's my Bri spiced chicken wings. Bri comes from South Africa. It is their take on a barbecue, even much more delicious. It's on an open fire. That's what a Bri means. And to get that smoky flavor, I'm gonna be using a smoked paprika. I'm also gonna be using my Instant Pot Duo Crisp and air fryer. I'm so excited to share this recipe. I know you can tell by my hand movements, so let's get started. So here are the spices that make up of our braai seasoning. It's a light brown sugar, kosher salt, coriander, smoked paprika, black pepper, garlic powder, allspice, and cayenne pepper, just a tad bit. I'm gonna go ahead and combine all of my spices into my chicken wings. You wanna allow this to marinate for up to an hour to 24 hours. You want the spice to really penetrate the chicken wings. So if you've got time, stick it in the refrigerator and kind of forget about it for overnight. So my wings marinated for about an hour. Now I'm ready to start cooking. I'm gonna take a half a cup of water and pour it into my Instant Pot. I'm gonna put a little lime at the bottom of my Instant Pot. This is gonna infuse citrus flavor into my wings. I'm gonna put my air fryer basket in the Instant Pot. I'm also just gonna spray a little bit of cooking oil at the bottom so that it does not stick. Then I'm gonna take my wings and spread them just on the base of my air fryer. If you can, try to spray your wings out all on the bottom. I might have to just double up a little bit, but they'll still come out delicious. And thou shall not leave any seasoning behind. Here's where the pressure cooking comes in. I'm gonna go ahead and close. There we go. I'm just gonna put it on pressure cook, five minutes, and then we're gonna start. So I'll see you back here in five minutes. Five minutes have gone by, so I'm gonna go ahead and let out the pressure. Be careful, take a step back to the side when you're doing that. I'm just gonna go ahead and remove our lid. I'll use my towels to remove the basket. Put it right into my bowl. Got my water here, I don't need it any longer, so I'm just gonna go ahead and pour it out. So don't be worried, the beeping is just the Instapot reminding me to put back my pot. So you wanna pat down your chicken wings just to ensure that there's not a lot of moisture on them. Go ahead and use your tongue just to move them around a bit to make sure that they're kinda of even in one layer. This is my favorite part, the air frying part. I'm still baffled by the fact that one equipment can do all of these things. So I'm gonna put our basket back in. Here we go. I'm gonna put our lid on. Then I'm gonna just hit air fry 400 and then for 16 minutes and I'm just gonna push start. It's already going. We're halfway to frying all of our wings. Be sure to use your base as to not burn your countertops. I'm just gonna go ahead and turn these a little bit. Oh, they smell incredible. There's a caramelization going on. There's a little bit of sweetness coming off of the wings. So this equipment is incredible. One of the things that I really adore about it is the dual feature that it has. I love that I can pressure cook something and air fry it all in one. It totally simplifies my cooking. I'm just gonna put our lid back on. And then we're here for another eight minutes. All right. Oh, they look really nice and crisp. Just be careful, make sure that you're using towels to remove your basket. Go ahead and put this on the side. I won't be needing it. I'll put this right back. I'm gonna again put this on my capability of sauteing. And this is my take on a buffalo sauce. So I'm gonna just use some tamarind date sauce from Best Best and about three tablespoons of butter. I'll just let this melt. Once that's done, I'm gonna use that to glaze my wings. If you don't have a tamarind date sauce, you're more than welcome to use a little bit of date syrup and some cider vinegar. It works wonders as well. It smells so good. You know, this tamarind sauce is tangy. It's also sweet. It comes from Somalia. It works well as a dip, as a saute, and also works really well as a glaze for wings and marinades. I'm just throwing back in my wings. I wanna coat them all in the sauce and butter. They smell sweet and tangy. I can already smell the smokiness of the paprika. Bry, that's what these are called. So I'm really, really looking forward to tasting them. I'm gonna go ahead and clean up and then I'll be right back to plate. 
they're crispy, they're falling off the bone. I have a little bit of citrus right here to cut the sweetness in them. Because my wings are air fried, you still get that crispy crunch, but it's not deep fried, so it's really healthy, easy to make. All of this came together under 30 minutes. I wanna give it a try and see if it tastes exactly like I'd imagined. Mm. Oh yeah, this is bry. The paprika has really come out. The sweetness of the sugar is on there. The tamarind date has really seeped into it. And if you're looking for more recipes like this one, be sure to subscribe to The Instant YouTube channel. And be sure to download the Instant Brands Connect app. I look forward to seeing everything that you all make. See you soon. Bye everyone.